Hi, I'm Anthony Hudson. Tonight's blockbuster is being held at GMHBA Stadium. We couldn't have asked for better conditions here. Well, joining me is the former Melbourne skipper. He played 226 games with the Demons, Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gas. Hey, Hutto, tonight should be a really special game. Taking the field tonight will be Geelong and North Melbourne. So they run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. The champions, you'll agree. North Melbourne is the team that plays to win for you. It's a big midfield battle today. Whichever team can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out winners today. Well, they've come out in force. And just look at them get behind the Cats as they make their way onto the ground. The banners are ready for the players. The captains make their way to the centre circle for the coin toss. North Melbourne kicking to the left of screen. Round six. These lineups look very strong, and both teams look fired up and set to go. Both sides look ready to get into the action just moments away now. The opening bounce at GMHBA Stadium. Guides it down. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Uses it now. Going for goal number one. North Melbourne. They're happy about that one. Pretty happy with that one. Puts the first goal on the board. About to resume hostilities. Abitangelo guides it down. Morrison Campbell's out into space. Kicks out of the congestion. Does well to cut off the kick. Just gets it onto the boot. Picked up by McDonald. Carney gets the loose ball. Gets a quick kick away. A good mark under the circumstances. The kick from Boyd. Goes for territory. O'Connor slams it onto the boot. Finds a target. Kirk goes with the kick. A chance to reload the attack now. Carney moves it now. She gives chase to the footy. Garner kicks an incredible goal off the ground. Gets her first. Celebrating hard. What a start for North Melbourne. That's a really good team goal. She did really well there and gets the reward. We're back in motion. Big thump from Ivy. McDonald, hurried kick. Abitangelo gets a quick kick away. Right, missed an opportunity to mark. Sells a bit of candy. Breaks through the tackle. Stands tall and marks. McDonald has resources out wide. She finds herself in space and marks. Wants to play on. Umpire penalises her, and it will be a free kick. Right, got her. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. A strong pack mark. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. Gibson delivers with the goal. Smiles all round. North Melbourne with a three-goal lead. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort.
It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Center bounce. Taps it down. She's got the football now. McMahon slick with the hands. Hickey brushed off easily. Tips it towards half forward. Ball gets cut off. Penetrating handball. Duffin decides to go it alone. A good result there. And that's a goal for North Melbourne. That pushes the lead further out. She acknowledges the crowd. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Abitangelo won the hit out. Didn't get low enough with the tackle. Punches the kick. Doing well to intercept that kick. Licks with hands. Brutton just dismisses Webster. Works it across the ground. Gibson has it. Uses it by foot. A big contested grab. With a driving kick. Just gets the kick away. Kirk. Dug out the loose ball. Showing some really good pressure there. Couldn't see off round. Constant pressure and rewarded. O'Connor sends it into space. She gets her hands on the footy. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Gets him reward for her efforts. North Melbourne have five unanswered goals. North Melbourne by five goals. North Melbourne needs to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too easily. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's just not enough effort out there at the minute. Garner got the tack. She's excited about that one. Geelong on the scoreboard now. Back in the middle now. Garner got in the better position. Goes off the ground. Darby lobs the handball. Cranston with a chance to light things up. No luck for him there. And it's a behind. Unable to make any inroads there. Geelong closed the gap to 23. Randall ready to bring it back into play. Marking in space was Abitangelo. Quick handball. It's a turnover. Garner gets the ball. Mops up the loose ball. Movement by hand. Just gave it away. No problems with that kick from Cranston. She sinks her first goal. She celebrates hard after that. Geelong have kicked the last two goals. They're starting to get on top. North Melbourne are leading by 17 as we go to the break. The Roos should be happy with their lead, Hutto. They came out focused and committed to a very good game plan. Well, we're out of the blocks with a frantic high-scoring opening term. I wonder what lies ahead. Let's analyze the stats. North Melbourne are doing a good job at cutting off the opposition attacks. Their intercept game is a key part of their defense. Thank you, Gaz. Ready to go for the second turn. The game is back underway. Ivy thumps it forward. Ashmore sees off McDonald. McWilliam takes the mark. Now with a low spearing kick, McMahon takes the mark uncontested with quick hands. At full stride, receives the handball. Ran hard to take that mark. Hurried kick. Van de Heuvel hacking it out of there. Fancy footwork, and it's a goal to Cranston. Congratulated by her teammates. Just under two goals the difference now. Back in the middle now. Swats it. She gains the possession. Hands that ball to the opposition. McDonald gathers it now. Got the hands free. Linking by hand. Ivy. Fair to mop up. Good mark there. Green winds up and goes long. Marks in a bit of space. Trent uses it by foot. Marked by Cashmore. Chose to kick it. Umpire pays the free for a deliberate. Garner making her way onto the field. Keeps the kick low. The ball finds McDonald. 
Slams it on the boot. Terrific mark there. Morrison has resources out wide. Good mark and looks to send it back. Carney puts it on the boot. Gains some territory. Gathered by Boyd. O'Connor picks up the loose ball. High tackle. O'Connor channels a long kick. Kirk uses the body well. Got boot to ball. Carney completing the race to the loose ball. Bateman steals possession. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Sinks the slipper into it. Found time to get it on the boot. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Up for grabs for Boyd. McDonald just streaming past and gets the footy. It's going to be deemed as deliberate. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Grierson did well to win that ball. Goes with the kick. Carney takes a strong mark. Goes by hand. The old one-two rushes with the kick. Couldn't take it. Humphreys decides to go for home. She's enjoying that goal. North Melbourne lead by 17. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. North Melbourne have taken charge of the contested ball. It's allowing them to create their scoring opportunities. North Melbourne are getting beaten at the coalface. They need to rectify these clearance numbers to give themselves the best chance going forward. Riddle releases the ball. She's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Duffin couldn't quite nail the kick. It's a three-goal lead to North Melbourne. Plays on. McWean hands it into open space. Going for goal number one. They are happy with that effort. King celebrating hard. North Melbourne increasing the lead to four goals. Garner thrashes it. Quickly onto the boot. Slams it onto the boot. Goes off the ground. Going for goal number one. Her teammates rush over. Back in the middle to resume play. North Melbourne need to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too often. Great tackle. Looking to kick goal number two. She slots this one. A big goal there. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. A four-goal lead. North Melbourne just starting to run away with this game. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. About to resume play. Punched away. Gary controls this one. Handballs. Takes possession. Spills the mark. Ball up in the centre square. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? Half time and it's North Melbourne 49 to Geelong 25. North Melbourne have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. Any thoughts from you, Gaz? North Melbourne are leading the contested ball numbers. It's always the starting point for a coach to find how well they attack the contest. Much appreciated, Gaz. The game promises plenty. We have a big second half coming up. A big second half about to begin. Back with another centre bounce. Abitangelo clears the contest. Takes that one strongly. Moves it by foot. Great mark. 
Grierson wants to play on. Ends up turning this ball over. O'Connor drives the kick. Strong mark in the contest. Move it on. King heads for home. Through for a point. The lead is now 25. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Missed the target. She's got the footy in her hands. Had plenty of the ball. Darby just gets it onto the boot. Doing well with the mark. Stabs at the kick. Puts on a big hit. Snaffled up by King. Got the hands free. Fighting hard was Bratton. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Hammers it. She has the ball. Receives the handball and takes off. Decides to soccer it. Dug out the loose ball. Manufactures the handball. Trying to avoid everything out there. Didn't get away from the tackle. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Intercepted. Finding the ball was Garner. Used the hands and gives away the free. She doesn't want to let her teammates down with this shot at goal. 65 metres out. Marks now and can send it back. A spearing kick. Gathers it now. And now we'll have a ball up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Going for goal number one. She's put it through. Ghana getting the crowd involved. Geelong reduced the margin. King gets onto the ball. Hit the man hard. Ivy was taken high in the tackle. Spears the ball. Kirk got hands to it. Just put it on the boot. Spent that one before she earned it. Gets the handball away. It's a turnover. Sweeping handball from King. Kicks hurriedly. Good mark by Humphreys. Keeps it moving. Is in her possession. Duffin with a chance for a third goal today. No issues with that drop punt. She loved that one. Now they lead by 25. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. North Melbourne played the contested possession at the moment and they're converting that lead into scoreboard pressure. Applies a bump. The handball now from McDonald. Morrison off the deck. Darby collects the loose ball. Lays the tackle. Great tackling there, Hutto. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Green with a drilling ball. Takes the mark. Uses it across half back. A great mark taken there. North Melbourne are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game is going right now. Boy slips high and gives away the free kick. Moved on by King. Great mark under pressure. A chance to put one through here for North Melbourne. Big kick required from this distance. Duffin looking for another goal here. Finds this and marks well. 15 metres out. She decides to go for home. Humphreys celebrates with the fans. That's two in a row for North Melbourne. 31 points the difference. Opportunity for Carney. She's in charge of the ranking points. She's doing everything right. Ivy run it best. 50 metres from home. She's able to ride it home from a long way. They get around her after that effort. 
Geelong behind. We head into the final term with North Melbourne 62 playing Geelong 37. North Melbourne believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. For well, both sides finding plenty of scoring opportunities that term. Abitangelo on top of the ranking points. She's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. Last quarter action, ready to go. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Abitangelo thumped it clear. Bateman got it high there. A low stabbing kick. It's a foot race to get this one. Right. Gurns a free kick. Normally a pretty good kick. Let's see what she can do here. Might be too far out to score. The margin is 26. Looking to bring it back into play. Mick Williams plays on. Elects to kick. McMahon releases by hand. Hacking it out of there. She takes aim. Suckers it through for a goal. Puts through her third goal. They increase their lead. Look at them celebrate that effort. Umpire ready to resume play. Abitangelo got a fist to it. Rushes with the kick. Drops the mark. Kicks hurriedly. She likes her chances from here. Gets some reward for her efforts. North Melbourne with the edge right now over Geelong. King gets it down. Finds the loose ball. Picks it up. Carney needs a chance to rest. Good body work to win the mark. Goes by foot. A solid mark from Mick Williams. Mick Williams sends one up towards the wing. Marked by McDonald. She spears the ball. Nice mark under pressure. Decides to kick. Finds this one all by herself. North Melbourne have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Looks like the ball will be coming back. So what can Geelong do with this opportunity in front of goal? Strong with the body and wins the mark. 45 metres out. Should be relatively straightforward from here. This kick to keep some hope alive. Geelong, seen one home. They kick the goal to stem the flow. Are we about to see a shift in this game? Celebrating hard. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. Getting in the way was Gehring. Clears the congestion. Cranston got under it. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Okay. She heads for home. And the chance at goal is taken by Geelong. Pretty happy with that one. Geelong have kicked back-to-back -back goals. It's all academic from here. The result won't change, only the margin. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. It's great to watch Hutto, plenty of excitement. We resume hostilities. King with the hit, ends up with Webster, dishes it off. Garner quickly onto the boot. Taylor just put it on the boot. Gehring is blowing hard after that effort. She can put it through. Seized the opportunity and was able to take it. Vandy Huber loves that goal. Geelong have kicked the last three goals. They're back in with a chance. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. North Melbourne are forcing the opposition to give it to the open player. They aren't allowing them any room to move forward. Just through the ball. They can just slow the game down now, take a bit of time off the clock. 
terrific mark there. Great grab. 45 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. Riddle sends the drop punt on its way for another goal. She acknowledges the crowd. North Melbourne doing well at the moment. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. North Melbourne need to be far more competitive with their clearance work. They can't win games that way. Sweeping handball. Green comes away with the ball. She just can't get out of the action. Boy sends one up towards the wing. McDonald kicks the ball deep. Couldn't snaffle it. Picked up now. Tackle knocks the ball loose. Needs a bit of a rest. Taylor marks uncontested. 40 metres from home. Lining up from a 45 degree angle. What a goal! Taylor loved kicking that. Not a great performance. And in the end, it was a poor result for Geelong. They weren't far off the mark, but they just couldn't keep their momentum together for long enough. At the final siren, the score, North Melbourne, 81, Geelong, 61. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. It's been a pleasure, Hutto, and we'll catch you next time. So join in the chorus and sing it once.